In this segment of uh, Leadership Matters, we continue to explore the person of the Lord Jesus Christ, who was the greatest example of what leadership is. And uh, one of the things that we observe about Jesus is that he was a leader given to integrity. One of the things that anyone should discover, whether you are a Christian leader, whether you are a business leader, or even a political leader, as soon as people discover you are not given to, 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 to good character, you are not a person of integrity, most people just walk away from you. The greatest security for a leader is their standard of life. Uh, I've written a book uh, which I've written examining the life of Nehemiah the prophet. And one of the most outstanding things about Nehemiah is Nehemiah had the moral authority to lead because of the kind of person he was. No one would have accused him of corruption. No one would have accused him of taking that which was not lightly his. And uh, one of the greatest things about Jesus, as we talk about him, is that uh, we learn powerful lessons because Jesus was given to integrity. And uh, without integrity, like we have said, people will not follow you. And uh, we also learn about the fact that uh, because of his lifestyle, another very important aspect about Christ's leadership is the kind of stories he told. In the encounter, uh, one of the things that we will discover about uh, leaders is that leaders sometimes will tell stories to explain a truth. And Jesus was a great storyteller. And uh, Jesus' stories have... Uh, with, uh, with stood the test of time. He preferred sto storytelling style uh, in the way he gave about his parable. Stories, uh, of course, we do have discovered in, in teaching there are certain things that we, we refer to as object lessons. Uh, and uh, stories are richer, more powerful, and long-lasting than directives or instructions. And we need to, each one of us can examine our lives. And uh, there are certain stories that I can give that can be able to explain the truth of what I'm talking about better. And one of the things that we are called to do in, as leaders is sometimes not to talk to people f from the top of, of, of their heads, but to try to identify with their situations of where they are and to also be able to give them a little bit of information about our journey. Because when you tell people about your journey of faith, they are able to relate to, with you better than when you are talking to them as if uh, they, they can't know how you connect with the reality of the truth. Therefore today, we learn about Jesus Christ. That as a great, great storyteller, he was able to turn these stories that he told to coaching lessons of telling his followers life-giving examples and so that they could be encouraged in pursuit of his calling. I pray that God will help us to learn to be leaders who can tell stories that can impact people's lives. Let's pray together. Father, we thank you because of the great example Jesus was in his leadership styles and the fact that uh, when he told uh, the parables and all the accounts that he shared, these are stories that we still use in our preaching today's day because they were life-giving. We thank you in Jesus' name.